guys, welcome to my channel. This is Tyra, Tyra No Banks or Tyra Kale, whichever one you want to call me. Stop what you're doing right now, and if you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and click that red button down below. And also, if you're not following any of my social medias, go ahead and follow. And also, if you want to purchase my um two books that I have that I actually wrote, I am a published author. They are also down below in the description box, so make sure you do that. Um, today I did do another video in this same shirt, outfit, you know, same setting and all of that. So if, um, you see me in this, I did record them on the same day, actually back to back. But, um, this is a more serious type of video and, and again, excuse the battery that's beeping going off. But, um, this is a more serious type of video. Um, as you can read the caption, um, I really don't know what I'm gonna name this yet, but it's got something to do with me not being enough and me feeling not pretty, basically. Um, I'm not gonna say that I don't think I'm pretty because I think I'm, like, I think I'm gorgeous, like, I think everybody should think of themselves highly and... I remember when I was in high school, I used to get bullied a lot. And it's like people find it really hard to believe that I got bullied. Me out of everybody that I got bullied. Because here now in college, I'm so vibrant on campus. And I'm always smiling. And I just know a lot of people, different types of people. Athletes, people in the SGA. Um, I guess, I don't know why people call them regular people that play Yu-Gi-Oh cards in the back of the union. I know people from every type of major, like, I just know a lot of people, and it's because I feel like you never know who, it's not, okay, it's not all about networking, but it's just like, you never know who's they, you'll make just by having a conversation with them, just by making a smile, and if I'm talking low, excuse me, but you just never know who, who's they you'll make just by speaking to them, hey, hello, I like your shirt, I like your hair, you look cute today, girl. You know, girl, you, you got a paper. You're going to get it done. Like, you always boost somebody up. And I'm just that type of person. I'm always boosting somebody up. And it's just, it feels weird to me when people boost me up. And it's, like, again, it goes back to me being in high school. Like, I, I really only, I could count my friends on my hand. On my hand. And sometimes it'll be like less than that, maybe two, three friends at a time or whatever, because it's just like, as I got through high school, like my freshman year got bullied like hell. My sophomore year got bullied. My junior year start, you know, easing up a little bit because of the person I was talking to or whatever, he was an athlete, football player, popular, whatever. And they was all like, how can a girl like her get somebody like him? And that's just like a whole nother story on... How I was basically being used and how my feelings were being played with and all of that stuff right there. That's just like a whole different story. That's just, it's crazy because now that I, like, basically, okay, basically with that situation or whatever, I thought me and him were together, right? And truth be told, he was with a whole bunch of other females too. That's just how it was. And recently me and him have talked or whatever. And I have asked him, does he see me being his wife and all that stuff. Of course he said, yeah. But I'm just like, in my mind, I'm just like, why am I, why am I sitting here asking him that? And the way he treated me in high school. And it's always, you know, that was back in the day. You know, don't get, get over, get over it. How am I going to get over something? And those were my feelings. Sorry, yeah, my phone got ready. But, um, yeah, I just, it's like a lot of stuff. Um, I run on my Facebook page, my personal Facebook page, that I felt like sometimes I'm not enough. And I just don't mean that in relationships. Because somebody did come in one person. I'm thinking, you know, people come, coming on my stuff. People don't really give a fuck about me for real. But one person said maybe they aren't enough. And I'm just like, in my mind, I was like, you know, that's some, that's some good ass shit to say. 
But what makes you think that I'm talking about being a, in a relationship with somebody? You feel me? Like, how you just, like, you just, that's the first thing you went to. I'm, I'm not even talking about being in a relationship. Because like I said in my life update video, if I did say it, my ex, he did me wrong. Like, he did me so dirty. Like, when I found out when his baby was finally here, whatever, no, we weren't together any time this year. We really stopped messing with each other. Not like messing, messing, but like talking to each other in November, I want to say. I think it was after my birthday. But it's just the fact that you were with me for so long. You let me pour my feelings out, this, that, and the fifth. And you were really somebody that I was playing in my life with. And then you going to have a baby? Like, that just, it was just so crazy to me how I was in that situation. But then, on top of that, he felt like he wasn't in the wrong because we were broken up. But you still cheated on me. But that's, <laughs> woo, like, I deal with some fuckboys in my life. And I'm only 22, and it's just like, I was talking to my friend um, last night or whatever. Shout out to you, Trey May. I'm giving you a shout out. Um, but I was talking to him last night and I was just like, can you give me some advice basically because all these dudes I'm talking to, dudes asking me for money? What? Asking me? I should be asking you for some money. Like, why are you asking me for some money? What? what? Or trying to talk to me when they ain't got nobody else to talk to. Like, I watch stuff. I watch stuff you post. I watch stuff you tweet. And I know you be watching me. I watch your Snapchat. Like... I, I watch you. I observe because I want to see who is trying to get to know me. And I, like I said, um, I was answering some questions on Twitter last night. And I, it was all like, why are you singing? I was just like, basically, dudes just don't want to get to know the real me. Or they just want to say that they talk to me. And I'm just like, who? Why, the, why am I so important that you just want to tell folks that you, you talk to Tyra? Like, what is it? Is it because of all the stuff that I got under me? Like... Me being a YouTuber, me being a published author, me being the owner of a lipstick collection, that, which is coming soon, me being an ambassador for a company. What is it? What is it? Me about to graduate with my bachelor's degree. What is it? Let me know. Because there's plenty of females out there that are doing more than me. But it's just like... I don't know. I'm not going to say I'm looking for a husband, but I'm just really, like, somebody to vibe with. I don't vibe with nobody for real. Like, they own some other type. Like, this generation, they really own sex. And I'm just like, baby, sex. Like, I can do without sex. I can do without it. Honestly and truly, I know it's, like, getting a little too personal. But honestly, I can do without sex. That's all I'm going to say on that topic. So it's just like, I feel like I'm not enough. I don't know is it if it's because I'm not where I want to be right now. Or is it because lately people been turning their backs on me that I didn't think that would turn their backs on me. I don't know if it's because I'm getting back to this bad stage in my life. To where I just want to curl up and be back in my eggshell. And I don't want nobody to bother me. And I really feel like that's where I'm going. Because, they, they, like, this is my spring break. Okay, top. This is my spring break, first of all. Am I at a beach? No. I mean, I'm supposed to be going to a beach, y'all. For a day. A, a day trip or whatever. But... I kind of don't want to go... Like, I don't want to go to the beach, but then I kind of sort of don't want to go to the beach. I don't know. Um, I just feel like being to myself. I feel like just reading out of books that I can read and sleeping my life away. But I cannot sleep past 10. Um, just people not talking to me and I feel okay. I don't know. I just feel like I'm not doing enough to where I can be noticed. I don't know what I'm really trying to say, but I just feel like I'm not enough. It's just like, Ty, when are you going to ever be enough for yourself, for somebody else, for the world, for 
anything like when are you going to be enough so i don't know if y'all got some encouraging words please leave them down below um and thank you guys for listening to me rant um and yeah so stay subscribed on the i forgot what i was calling y'all i don't really like calling y'all the lady books no more so team tyra or i don't know y'all have me come up with a name to call y'all my kings and queens i think i'm gonna just stick with that my kings and queens because you never know who's watching your video but yeah th again thank y'all for listening to me rant make sure y'all subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video Bye.